Newfoundlanders are facing a full day of shoveling after Friday's record-setting blizzard, but there may be even more nasty weather to come. Environment Canada has issued weather warnings and statements for much of the island, except for the west coast and northern peninsula. A snowfall warning has been issued for central Newfoundland, calling for 15 centimeters while another 10 centimeters is expected for eastern parts of the island. The messy conditions could be worsened by a changeover to rain. Overnight in the St. John's area and wind gusting to 80 kilometers per hour. While a state of emergency continues in St. John's, the city has listed some restrictions. Private snowplow operators will be able to start snow clearing work immediately, and gas stations will also be allowed to open for the purposes of fuel for snow clearing. Also, an exception has been made for pharmacies in St. John's, Mount Pearl, Paradise, and Torbay. They are allowed to open between noon and 7 p.m. Sunday following an urgent request from Eastern Health. If you do not require medication, please do not leave your home, said a statement from the city of St. John's. If you must leave your home for medication please take your time, drive slowly, watch for snowplows and pedestrians. Even with the easing of some restrictions, the city is still advising people to stay in and on. St. John's Mayor Danny Breen said while crews have had a lot of success and worked through the night, there's still a lot to be done. Breen said a series of storms has had snowplow operators working steadily since Christmas Eve and said they are getting help from Corner Brook as well as other levels of government. We all work together and well get through it. The province's English school district has proactively announced that all schools on the Avalon Peninsula will be closed Monday. Several schools on the Bonavista Peninsula will also be closed.